Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a art collab by the lovely Sharon. She's so fabulous. It's basically an open collab where you can um, you do a abstract art piece and you talk about it and your feelings and everything else. It's an open collaboration for anyone who's interested. So if you guys want to see what I came up with and what I drew and painted, go ahead and keep on watching the video. So I wanted to do something that had to do with life and um, so I started off uh, designing it with hands but I wanted it to be abstract. I didn't want it to look like hands so the first thing that I drew was a set of hands that were going to represent me and basically my hands. So I'm using a piece of um, foam board to draw this and uh, nothing fancy. Next I wanted to illustrate life and that is what that circle represents. And I did different colors there because I felt that life deals us with different things, good things, bad things. Um, also we're all different nations and colors and races. And also that life is not always fair. It does, um, some people are born into really rich families, some are born into poor families. So it just represented life and all the different shades and different things that life gives and how it is handed out to us and obviously it all pours into our hands and so I use a lot of different colors grays blues um, pinks reds just representing different aspects next I just kind of shaded in the the hands and um, I didn't want this to be too thought through I didn't have any music playing I didn't want to be really inspired by anything I just wanted to really have this come from within and so I painted from the heart. Um, as I went along, I would add certain things and then I would remove them and paint over them based on just how I felt in the moment. And so that's how um, this painting came about. It felt really nice. It was a really rare moment in my life where my house was actually quiet. <laughs> and so it was really nice to be able to sit there and paint um, freely like that. So right now I'm just painting this green and yellow area which basically represents the earth which is where we are and that area that looks like horns is supposed to essentially be our heart and I drew it into a heart and the heart of man according to the Bible is evil and desperately wicked so I started with darkness and as life and different, different things happen to us and also as we get to come to know the Lord then the light shines through and of course I added the white to represent salvation to represent um, the Word of God and also um, some other colors that represent our gifts and um, the goodness that we do still have in there sometimes but it's just all deep inside it's pretty dark because that's just our nature our sin nature is dark next I just drew an actual heart I, I didn't want it to look like our typical um, design of a heart I drew it to look more realistic and so just to show that um, that burst of color above it was just basically pouring into the heart. So um, I continued on and added um, this pink because I am a woman, I'm a girl, so um, I felt like the pink was representative of like our feminine energy. And so since um, we're women, we also have different aspects in our lives. I shaded that in and uh, the red that I'm painting right now represents all the pain and all the suffering and all the bad things that life deals us. I know it sounds really like negative, but it's really not. But life can be hard for some of us sometimes and we all face difficult situations from illness to financial troubles to, you know, all different things. So that represents pain, that represents reality, that represents what life gives us. And the blue represents what God is trying to do for us and the hope, um, the answers to our prayers and um, the positivity that's trying to fight back to overcome all the negativity basically. I then shaded in a little bit of the earth area just to give it like more color and I added more color to the feminine energy because we are complicated. Women are complicated. We have all kinds of different emotions, different facets to our, to our personalities and just being a woman. Nobody understands us except ourselves. So I felt adding different colors just kind of shaded and illustrated us better. And then finally I started going in with the brown. Now I'm using the brown to represent myself and 
what that is is basically me trying to fight things myself so all these difficulties in the red you see the brown kind of going over the red trying to fight it and all at the same time God is trying to send us answers to our prayers and the things we ask for and a lot of the time you know there you'll see some areas that are white and some areas that are darker in the brown sometimes we try harder to fix our problems ourselves and sometimes we do allow God to come into our lives and fix things for us and allow him and his miracles and his prayers and our prayers to be answered by him and so it's like that constant struggle of surrendering faith and surrendering our um, willingness and our own attitudes to his so that we can actually receive the blessings and I thought it was realistic to my life and it really could apply to just about anyone any Christian that um, struggles through life and just goes through every day and then <laughs> deals with things and then try to fix it themselves so I I hope this made sense um, like I said it was a rare moment where it was quiet in my uh, my house so I felt really nice painting this this was very relaxing so um, I hope you guys are enjoying it and it's not like a hot mess and looks crazy but anyway moving along here um, I started painting this blue area here I wanted it to kind of hide the hands or the forms of the hands because that represents our facade and what we portray and project to the world nobody really knows what's happening underneath except for us and our close friends or maybe close family and so the blue is pretty much our outward appearance and how we are um, seen by the rest of the world and it's usually our best food that we try to put forward and I chose this blue color because well I felt like it went with everything but also that's my favorite color right now so I thought it would be my best foot forward it would represent that the best and then I drew a couple of pair of eyes I thought it went really well with like the um, abstract theme you always see kind of stuff like that in abstract art but it just happened that I did that because I felt that it represented the um, outside world and the eyes were how what people were seeing it was just their eyes looking down at us but not really knowing everything that's happening in there and then I just did um, those little lines to just kind of make it a little bit silly because it's me and that is my piece of art I'm pretty proud of this I thought it really um, did you know justice to my thoughts and my feelings and it may look like a hot mess to some of you I don't know what you're gonna see leave me a comment down below let me know what you actually see and if you felt I illustrated my intention um, well if you like it if you don't like it what you like about it leave me a comment let me know um, I did put it in a frame it's a Dollar Tree frame that I found that would fit the cardboard piece but I think I'm probably going to put it in a different frame later on it's 11 by 13 right now it's not really big but I really, I really like it because, hey, it's my creation. It was so fun to make. So I thank Sharon for opening this collab. Thank you so much for watching. Please check out my social media. If you don't already subscribe to me, please subscribe. And I will talk to you in my next video. God bless. Bye-bye.